I'll be like a presenter, you know, the, the girl. Ah. Yeah, but they're usually pretty. I'm joking, you're pretty. I'm joking. I'm joking, you're cute. Right. Mystery box. Ow, my nose was against that. <laughs> <laughs> this, this is this is the mystery box, but this is not our um, our own. No, this is not homemade our one. uh, ones. This is the ones uh, from Firebox. Firebox, have um, delivered again. But our last <laughs> video, which I'll put a link to anyway, was um, gadgets, um, and we got quite a lot of views on that, and we thought we'd do another one. And this one is a different theme. It's unusual. So it's an unusual mystery box. An unusual mystery box. Now, it was about... We haven't opened it for like over a week. If there's a dead puppy in here, I won't no, be happy. No, it's bulging out, isn't it? It's bulging Bul out. Look, 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 look at this. It's bulging. But it was stuff. about £25-ish, I think. And there's about £35 worth of stuff inside. Um, but obviously you don't know what it is. So mm. let's find out what it is. Okay. Let's... Let the mystery begin. Right. Oh, I'll, I'll, I'll get yeah. these ones out there, shall I? Right. It's something big and squishy. It's red with eyes. Let's, let's get it out for packaging straight away. What is? It looks like a key cap. Looks evil like a key It cap. looks, well, it, yeah. <gasps> it's a hand muff, I think. And look, that's, that's not rude. That is actually what they're called. Um, it's a monster cushion. But were these supposed to just be able to look? It's got. Yeah, I'm sure it's about like a hand yeah. sort of thing, isn't magic. it? magic! Yeah, so I used to have one of these as a child and you'd walk around. What, one of them? Well, not quite like that. The but idea. You, you would have your hands warm on a, on a cold day. That's what they used to use in Victorian times. But anyway, you've got a little kitty cat. It's very soft. Yeah. Yeah, that's ah. cool. <laughs> now, the next thing. Can I keep this? Yes. The next thing looked quite dodgy, actually. <laughs> <laughs> this wasn't the. It's a virus. It's a stress virus. <laughs> My nephews watch this. <laughs> I don't even want to get this out. <laughs> You're supposed to squeeze it <laughs> when you get stressed. <laughs> you should put it away. <laughs> That's that. And it'll never come out of that box again. <laughs> <laughs> can't get it in. <laughs> right, I can't get it in the box. <laughs> content on this. Right. <laughs> it's not one of them before you ask, it's not, but it just very looks very dodgy. It's a stress reliever. <laughs> <laughs> no. right, okay. Should we move on? Oh you seem to have a Game Boy game? It's a Game Boy game character. <sighs> um a, <sighs> sorry. Uh Pokemon. But it's actually red soap. It's soap. Oh, let's have a look. Whew. Something a bit more cleaner. So you can take an holiday. Well, there you go. 
That's really cool. I like that. It's actually quite detailed. I don't know if this will pick it up at all, but it's it is quite detailed. So it's Pokemon game. Let's it's see what the even got like the bit at the bottom oh. where the where the, groove, it isn't slightly, it? the, yeah, the actual where the chip would be. Yeah, it's it just says Pokemon. It's um, obviously some kind of like copy. I, I like that. It's just quite cute. It's novelty and interesting. <laughs> I'm just going to ignore you. I'm actually going to take it out of this in case when we put it up to the camera, it might have the lights shining on it. Perhaps you couldn't see. So. There it is, the uh, cartridge, and there's sort of the grooves. <laughs> Gas top here. Um, so yeah, so that, that's <coughs> the Pokemon soap. Which I'll just put back in there as it is, because we don't need it. Oh, please don't just What's going on? Oh, right. Sorry, it's all good for that then. I don't know. Let's check out the bag first. Oh my god. It's a... It's horrible. It's like a... It's like a real miniature deer head that lights up to put on your wall. Thanks. It's just what I wanted. Although looking at it, it's actually a hook. You can put your keys on it. There's a, there's a picture just there putting your keys on it. Great. It's pretty unuseful. Yeah, I'm sure we can find a use for that or a gift it to somebody. Shall I take it out or shall I do this box? It's a hunting trophy door light. Okay, the battery's in it. Oh, is it? I, I said, are oh, the batteries in it? Oh, I don't know. Okay. Yes, there is. Now, my father actually has, you it's know, magnetic not, not, not the actual head thing, but you know, the, the, the antlers. They don't light up. No. Okay, so what does it say? Mounts easily. Sorry, going back to the. How does it turn on? Well, you pull the tab out. Right. Perhaps it's. Uh, is it? Is it? Is it mo right. When you're when you open a door, the animal will illuminate the surrounding area. When the internal vibration sensor detects motion, the LED will light up for approximately twenty seconds. After which, it will automatically turn off. Recommended for ages 15 or over. <laughs> okay, um, so let's recap. <laughs> Hammoth. Basically, we've got... Uh, a stag. A garish, a garish stag, a muff, a sex toy and some soap. <laughs> Love. It's a stress ball. <laughs> a stress thing. Um, stress, yes, it, it makes was, me very stressed. It was very interesting. Um, I like that. I like the soap. The soap, yeah, yes. I do. I'm a gamer, so um, I like the soap. I have to be honest, because really I should be. Because this, you know, this is our opinion on what we're unboxing and stuff. And the dog, uh, oh. the dog uh, likes the box, so. Oh, it wasn't in there, was it? No. Oh, thank you. I have to be honest, um, not stuff I would go out and buy. Maybe I would, I probably would, you know, I know what I'm like, I probably would come home with something like that one day, you know what I'm like. Um, the rest of it, probably not. Um, so yeah, I mean, I preferred the gadget one, that was much more, in, you know, interesting. But everyone's tastes are different, aren't they? Thing is though, I don't think they change what's inside, so once you get the gadget <laughs> one, you get the gadget one, but I think... This one might have changed. Because I've seen unboxings of this before and it weren't any of this stuff. And that was a few years ago. So I mean, you know, reviews are an interesting thing, but like you say, if you do a mystery box, you can't please everybody. Everyone's different with taste. You know, this stuff doesn't really float my boat. But, you know, there might be other people who would absolutely love that and think this box is fantastic value for money. Uh, we will find a use for almost everything that came out of them. <laughs> Yeah, we will find a use for almost everything. Perhaps this could, could be Icy's Nightlight, you know, one that stabs her in the eye. <laughs> she gets me. No, we, no, we wouldn't do that. Yeah, animal safety. Look after your pets. Don't do drugs. Um, <laughs> yeah.
Yeah, so what do you think? I just said what I think. I like that. <laughs> That's pretty much all Gavla has to say. It's quite cool though. Yeah. The idea of it's good anyway. I mean, to be honest, it might be funny in the garage. You know, we probably mentioned the garage. It's a mysterious place where all of Gav's stuff that <laughs> the light, light goes. Well, it looks nice when you open the door, it lights up. Mm -hmm. It stabs you in the <laughs> eye. Joy. You go in like that to protect yourself. Okay. Until we do another one? Yeah, till the next one. Bye. Bye.